Hello, astronomy enthusiasts worldwide. In today's episode, we will delve into an intriguing topic, asteroid 2007 FT3. Although concerns about a potential collision with Earth have arisen, NASA has assured that there is no risk. Let's examine this fascinating story in more detail. On March 20, 2007, at the Mont Lemmon Observatory in Arizona, astronomers detected asteroid 2007 FT3 with a diameter of approximately 340 meters. Initially, calculations indicated a possible collision with Earth. However, this asteroid was quickly classified as lost by NASA as it was observed for only 1.2 days before disappearing due to its unfavorable position. Despite being sighted 14 times before becoming invisible, 2007 FT3 was excluded from crucial collision risk lists due to a lack of precise data. In September 2019, similar speculations arose but the asteroid did not collide. Now, with more recent observations, calculations have been refined, and it is clear that 2007 FT3 poses no threat of collision with our planet. It's important to note that, after being rediscovered, the asteroid was removed from the sentry list, which maps potential impacts with Earth. NASA reiterated that there are no known asteroids over 140 meters posing a significant threat in the next 100 years. Therefore, to the relief of everyone, 2007 FT3 is out of danger regarding a collision with Earth. It's worth emphasizing that the ability to refine orbital parameters through additional observations plays a crucial role in monitoring near Earth objects. Additionally, I shared unfortunate news about the Peregrini mission, which faced propulsion system issues, reducing the chances of a successful landing on the moon. The challenges faced by space missions underscore the complexity and intrinsic difficulties in these thrilling endeavors. I hope this explanation has clarified the situation of asteroid 2007 FT3 and provided additional details on other crucial developments in the field of astronomy. If you have more questions or comments, please feel free to share below. Thank you for tuning in.